Yo, what is going on YouTube? Hope everyone's having an amazing day today. And yeah, in today's video, we got an amazing GTA 5 video for you. All you want to do is make sure you go ahead and subscribe if you are new around here so you're always kept up to date with the channel. As well, follow my Twitter at YTVenomPlays. It'd be much appreciated. Also, shout out to this amazing person on screen right now. If you would like a shout in a future video, all you have to simply to go ahead and do is comment hashtag VenomPlays. And I'll be sure to show you in a future video. Now let's go on to the video. So here's a quick word from our sponsor. If you're looking for the best GTA 5 account services, then be sure to check out the Gizani. They are literally the best in the game as it goes for account services, all that their stuff, as well use code VENOMPLAYS for 5% off your order. Also, Digizani are currently doing giveaways, so make sure to go ahead and check all them out, as you can literally win Xboxes, all that their good stuff, as well join their Discord, which will also be linked down below, so you're kept up to date with Digi giveaways. Now, back to the video. Yo, what is going on YouTube? Welcome back to a brand new video. In today's video, I'm going to show you an easy gift card to friends glitch where you can get any single car you want for absolutely free. All you want to do for this is simply call any car from your arena and then simply make your way over to the actual new uh, car meet place. And then all you want to do from there is simply drive into the car meet place. Once in the car meet place, then all you want to do from there is simply get back into your car and then just enter the racetrack with the actual car that you did get from your arena. So all you want to do is, like I said, simply get back into your car and then press X and then go enter track. It does not matter if you do it alone or with friends. Simply just go ahead and enter the racetrack. Once in the racetrack, all you want to do is simply go ahead and call Gerald or Simeon and then just simply request a job. Now, you, this will take about 3-4 seconds for the job actually to show up. So while you're, while you're waiting on the job to actually show up, simply aim your car back towards the entrance of the actual car meet place. And then as soon as you get the job, hover over it to actually join it. And then as soon as you're doing that, you just want to drive uh, as fast as you can into the actual entrance. And then as soon as you actually see your car does in fact stop, quickly accept the job and just spam A. So here, as you want to see, you just want to simply accept the job as you're driving in. And then it will actually, if you done it correctly, it will load you into the job and you will see the screen does start to flash. Once you load in and you can see the screen flashing, then you just want to press B and actually quit the job. Then it will return you into this here car meet place and then all you want to do is simply locate your car. And if you know you've done it correctly, you will see you do not have a minimap. Once you simply have got back to your car, simply drive it out and head over to your arena. Now once you do head over to your arena, this is where you actually just want to drive and actually select the first option. So as you will see in here in just a second, you just want to drive into the arena and accept the first option. Then all you want to do from there is you will see you start to fall uh, through the map. Then what you want to do is simply make your way over to the postal office. Usually where the car place actually is, where all these gift cards friends are. Simply make your way over to the post office uh, area. And then have your friend bring the car that you do in fact want. And then all you want to do is simply call a car that you don't mind losing. And then simply call your MOC and park it anywhere in this street. And then simply have your friend get inside. Now once your friend does in fact get inside your car. Then all you want to do from there is simply go ahead and have them sit in the pause menu. And then what you want to do is once they are in fact on the pause menu. Then you just want to simply drive to the back of the MOC. Make sure you have a vehicle in the back of the MOC to where you get uh, that there alert. And then simply accept the alert and your friend will in fact get kicked out of your car. Then simply reverse your car uh, back up the hill. And then try the story mode option just to get that alert sort of popping up. And then sort of run to the back of your MOC. And then as soon as you uh, hit enter alone, then you just want to hold down the D-pad. And then flick up with your analog stick to where you get the alert. Once you have the alert, simply just decline it and then you will see you start to fall through the map. And then simply, then when you spawn on top, then you will be invisible and then simply get inside your car and boom, there you go. You now have your friend's car. You can simply repeat this over and over again just from the postal office. As you will see, I will actually show you me doing it repeated method to where you can get as much cars as you do want in GTA 5 Online. So yeah, that's it for today's video. If you did go to enjoy it, be sure to drop a like and subscribe if you are new around here. And yeah, Venom plays. Bye.